Hello. This weekend is a significant weekend in the life of the Northern Baptist Association family of churches. Because this weekend we are marking the 200th anniversary of the death of what David Meal in his book The Baptists of North East England would say is the most significant person in the history of all of our Baptist life in this part of the North East. The Reverend Charles Whitfield. He was minister here in Hampstead, minister of this church for 50 years. Under his ministry, this building was erected. Under his ministry, in the first three years, this church doubled in size. It was able to plant new congregations. He, Whitfield was an itinerant preacher and evangelist who helped plant new churches in other parts of the North East. He was a theologian and studier of God's word and studier of many other uh, fields as well. He was a polymath. He started a school here in the village. He travelled widely around the North East. He was a great influence on many other people. He also helped to revive what at the time was a dead uh, relationship of churches. The Northern Baptist Association did exist but it hadn't been meeting for several years and Whitfield helped to bring it back into life and enable churches to relate to each other more closely again. Why am I telling you all this? Well, we don't just want to remember the past. The past can help us draw inspiration for the present and the future. Would that the revival that happened here in this place under the ministry of Whitfield happen in your church in 2021 and in these years ahead? Would that the life of prayer and devotion to God that Whitfield had, had be the same life that we would choose to lead today? Would that that pioneering spirit, that wholehearted commitment to mission that Whitfield had also be ours today as well? Our prayer this weekend is that in all our churches, in your church, we would see wholehearted devotion to God in the spirit of Whitfield. We would see commitment to mission in the spirit of Whitfield. We would see church growth in the way that it happened under Whitfield. We would see people called into ministry and into pioneering mission, just as Whitfield was called many, many years ago. We also pray for this particular place, Hampstead, as a vision is developing that a new monastic community, a community of prayer and mission, might become established here and reach out and use this place, which is a beautiful chapel, a beautiful thin place where God's presence is felt very closely, as a centre for fresh life in our region, our association, and maybe more widely as well. As I finish today, please join with, with me in a prayer, just expressing our commitment afresh to serve God wherever he will lead us in these days as we emerge out of pandemic restrictions, as we plan out an uncertain future, but a future that is certain in the hands of God if we follow him to bring life and growth and blessing. So pray with me as I use words from the Northumbria community with their kind permission. Lord, I will trust you. Help me to journey beyond the familiar and into the unknown. Give me the faith to leave old ways and break fresh ground with you. I believe you will make a way for me and provide for me if only I trust you and obey. I will trust in the darkness and know that my times are in your hand. I believe you for my future, chapter by chapter, until all the story is written. Through Jesus Christ and the love of the Father and the grace and power of the Spirit. Amen. Thank you.